Get ready to enter the military universe with the Titan Tar Channel. Today we will explore about Abrams tanks achieving maximum power with RTX electrical generators. Don't forget to subscribe, like and share with your friends who appreciate this subject. Collins, a subsidiary of Raytheon, has been awarded a $24 million contract by the U.S. Department of Defense to supply generators and electrical containers intended to power the U.S. Army's Abrams M1A2 battle tanks. The Abrams M1A2 System Enhanced Package Version 3 is a modernization of the Abrams combat tank in service with the U.S. Army. This new version offers greater protection, survivability, and lethality compared to its predecessors, with emphasis on the RTX generator which plays a fundamental role in supplying energy for advanced systems. The tank also features technological advances in areas such as armor, communication, reliability, maintenance, and fuel efficiency. As part of the Army's SCPV-3 program aimed at improving the performance and extending the service life of the M1A2, the Collins generator will provide 50% more onboard power compared to the tank's previous system while occupying the same space. This will result in an increase in the survivability and reliability of the tank. A Collins program manager noted that to date, the company has delivered 800 electrical generators as part of the SEPV3 program, which provide critical power, diagnostics, and predictive maintenance support on the ground. With the increased power capacity, the electrical generator will contribute to improving the survivability of the M1A2 enabling the integration of advanced systems such as laser warning receivers and radio jamming capabilities. The U.S. Army has incorporated unmanned turrets into armored vehicles such as the M1A2 Abrams and Stryker, aiming for greater precision and situational awareness through advanced sensors and targeting systems. These towers demand a lot of electrical processing power, especially with the increasing autonomy and connectivity of the systems. The generator employed utilizes advanced magnetic technology and active load management to deliver 100% of rated power to the M1A2 across all operating ranges. This advancement is significant as the defense industry seeks to reduce unnecessary energy consumption, aligning with ESG principles. This focus reflects one of the main trends in the sector, as indicated by the increase in the number of related patents. Collins designed these generators to fit into the same space as legacy systems, minimizing the need for significant changes to existing vehicles or electrical architecture. This flexible approach is crucial as the U.S. Army advances systems integration across its combat force, which becomes increasingly multi-domain. It's always a pleasure to share our discoveries and knowledge with you here on the Titan Tar channel. Don't forget to subscribe, turn on notifications, and leave your comment. To the next!